Hello everyone, I am Deborah. Welcome back to my channel and to my kitchen where I have been finding and making keto friendly recipes that will keep us focused, satisfied, and in keto. Well, you guys, recently, well, a lot, <laughs> I've been dreaming about different recipes that I can make and bring it to you guys and today is no exception. So recently I have been dreaming about You guys see that? That is bang, bang shrimp. So no longer do we need to dream. I'm getting ready to make it. So if you want to learn how to make it as well, then come right back and I'll show you how. All right, everyone, welcome back. Let's go ahead and get into making this bang bang shrimp recipe. So what we're gonna start with is actually the seasoning of the batter. So right here what I have is some oat fiber that is gonna serve as a flour. Then I have some whey protein that is gonna serve as the breadcrumb. And of course here is the egg wash. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to season the whey protein and you season it according to your liking. So I have here probably based upon the amount of shrimp that I have, this is probably about three quarter cup of the whey protein, I'm gonna put probably about a uh, quarter teaspoon of salt. And again, depending upon your taste. Okay. And then I also have some garlic powder. And about the same for that. But I like to taste the seasoning, so I typically go more towards a half teaspoon side. Then some black pepper. And this is about a quarter teaspoon. And lastly, some paprika. All right, okay, get these out of the way. Okay, go ahead and give this a mix. And this is right, okay? And if you're curious to find out where I purchased these, both of these I actually got from Amazon. All right, so let's go ahead and put that aside. So, for the sake of speed, what I am going to do, I'm gonna do, remember the Shake and Bake commercial where you have a bag and then you put the little flour or batter mixture in the bag? That's what I'm gonna do with this fiber, oat fiber. Go ahead and put this in a bag. And then I'm going to put the shrimp in there. Okay, and these are the shrimp. And of course, they're clean, they're peeled, and they are deveined. Go ahead and slide those into this bag as well. So I can coat these. just like that, these are coated, okay? And they are ready. All right, these are now ready to get dipped into this egg. Make sure it's coated so that the 
protein mix will stick to it. And there we have it. And we just continue on like this for the rest of them. And then these will be ready to go over to the stove to fry. And I have some avocado oil for that. And I also purchased that from Amazon as well. So you guys, let me continue on with sledging these through this egg wash, as well as this whey protein. And the next time you see me will be at the stove top. I'll see you soon. As I mentioned earlier, I am using avocado oil, which is the perfect oil if you are on a keto friendly diet. I put this battered shrimp into this preheated oil. And of course, for the sake of time, I have sped up this video. This shrimp is frying up to a golden consistency. And it is now ready. I take it out. And I must say, I could have eaten this shrimp just like this. But again, we are making a bang bang shrimp recipe. So I have to be patient. And here it is, fried to perfection. All right, everyone. This shrimp is fried, I might say, to perfection. Golden brown. Okay, so now that this is ready, I'm going to set it aside so that we can make this sauce. So I have to tell you guys, I did get ahead of myself. While that was cooking, I went ahead and started making this. So let me tell you what I did. I took a half a cup of mayonnaise, okay, and into it, I added two to maybe three tablespoons of this sriracha hot chili sauce. And then I added one teaspoon of this rice vinegar. And this is where we are. When I realized I wasn't filming, I said, okay guys, we can make it work. Something that is so incredibly delicious is so simple to make. Now this is smooth creamy and it smells spicy just the way it's supposed to be for a bang bang sauce. Okay, let's give it a taste. Guys, oh my goodness, that's good. <laughs> okay, so the next thing we're gonna do is go ahead and put it over this shrimp. And then the next thing, we will be serving this up. Oh. This looks and smells incredible. Wow. And I don't uh, think I mentioned before, I had about half pound of shrimp. I'll go ahead and give this a stir and make sure that this shrimp is well coated with this sauce. Okay. And that is what that's looking like. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna let this sit just so that sauce can just like really saturate this shrimp. And in about 10, 15 minutes, I'll be back with you and we're gonna serve this up and I'll let you know just how good it is. I'll be right back. Hello everyone, I am back. So while this was sitting here soaking up this delicious bang bang sauce, I decided to go ahead and take a shower. I had gotten home from work and got into this kitchen. So I went ahead and took a shower, got refreshed, cleaned up this kitchen. So that way I can sit back and really 
enjoy this meal without any interruption. So what I've done is I put some lettuce at the bottom of my serving bowl here and we are going to serve up this bang bang shrimp. Go ahead and put it right on top. Oh, you guys. This is phenomenal, absolutely phenomenal. There is this um, restaurant that my husband and I used to go to. We haven't gone there recently, but every time we went there, without question, I would get the bang bang trip and he would get the uh, fish tacos. As a matter of fact, if you want to see me make some fish tacos, please do leave that in the comments below and I will be more than happy to share that recipe with you as well. And if you wanted to, what you could do as well is you could chop up um, or dice up some tomatoes and put that on it. And then you can also put some um, green onions on the top of this. But this for me is perfect as is. So, let me go ahead and take a picture of this, and then when I come back, I am going to dig into this shrimp. All right, you guys, let's eat. Oh, so good. <clears throat> this tastes as good, if not better, than the restaurant. And I also know that it is keto friendly because of what I battered the shrimp in, what I fried it up in, and of course the sauce. Absolutely delicious, you guys. This sauce is creamy, it's spicy, and it just complements this shrimp perfectly. You guys have got to try this. And when you do, leave your comments below and let me know that it is just as good as I say that it is. Okay, you guys. I'm going to sign off so I can get on with my evening and let you get on with yours. But please do give this video a thumbs up. Please do share. And if you're not yet part of my YouTube family, please press that subscribe button below. I would love, love, love to have you along for my journey. And remember, you guys, to remain safe, healthy, and encouraged until we meet again. Keep growing. Keep thriving. Keep pushing those boundaries. And I will see you all real soon on my next I've Got Something to Say to Bone Appetit.